Ryan. After our first date, I thought I might like you. After our second date, I couldn't wait to see you again. Once we began spending most days together, I missed you when you weren't around. And eventually, I realized that I had become a better person simply for having you in my life. So, I still remember walking into that computer room and sitting next to you, not yet knowing the profound importance of that meeting. I told you about the cricket incident, and instead of walking away in disgust, like many people might have done, you actually spoke with me, joked with me, and even agreed to meet with me outside of work. This was the first time I got a glimpse of the endless breadth of your kindness, and I would discover much more as we grew together as well. I've known Ashley for about six years now, but I knew her as a very driven, a very disciplined, and very goal-oriented. We all know that. She knows what she wants. And Brian is truly lucky to have found such a mature, beautiful woman for the rest of his life. And most importantly, someone who can keep him in check. And, you know, to Brian, Ashley's place is ice cream. Once upon a time, Brian and I we went to um, All You Can Eat for Faith. After about 30 or so ribs, Brian told me, hey, Joe, you want to get some ice cream? I looked at him like, I don't know, man. He's like, but it's ice cream. It feels in the cracks. You can always have some ice cream. And honestly, that's a beautiful metaphor. I think for the relationship Brian has with Ashley, no matter how busy his day is, how hectic his day is, at the end of the day, he will always have room for his sweet, sweet Ashley. When I asked Brian, this is what he wrote. He said, Ashley always thinks of me. If she goes to the bakery or the dessert shop, she brings me back a treat. I love desserts. Now what did Ashley write down, not knowing what Brian had said? Ashley said, Brian loves food more than anyone I know. But he always, always, always saves the last bite for me. Brian says, Ashley pushed me to pursue the career I always wanted. She reassured me when I quit my job and supported me while I was in the police academy. What does Ashley say? Whenever I say that I think I want to try something, Brian immediately starts researching and planning it. He's going to make it happen. He ran a half marathon with me, although he doesn't really like running long distances. She says, lastly, he even took dance classes with me at a local studio. You're always smiling and forever optimistic. Your exuberance brightens any room you walk into. You're accepting other of others, never judging and always caring. You're lighthearted and respectful, and you're unwavering in all these things that make you you. Ashley, you've become to me what air is to life. Without you, I cannot exist. So from now and evermore, I will be holding your hand, walking beside you as we pay my path. Your patience and steadiness calms me. Your unwavering acceptance of my quirks gives me confidence. You are uniquely you, and with you, I get to be uniquely me. And we are unique together. To me, real happiness is achieved not in a moment. Rather, it is worked for over many years. So your happiness has become my happiness. And so today and every day from here on out, I promise to work towards building a happy life with you. Ladies and gentlemen, it gives me great joy to introduce to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Ryan and Ashley Lowe. After meeting Brian and spending some time with the two of them, it quickly became clear to me that Brian brings out the best in Ashley. 
It goes without saying that Brian is friendly, fun, and confident. His calm, supportive manner complements Ashley's energy and drive. Brian, as someone who has known Ashley for 25 years, I can vouch that you can count on Ashley to treat your marriage with loyalty, responsibility, and intelligence. I'm so grateful that my lifelong friend married her best friend today and that you're all here to witness it. Ashley and Brian, my final advice comes from the great philosopher Lou Holtz, who was the coach at Notre Dame. Yay. <laughs> Everyone needs something to do, someone to love, something to hope for, and someone to believe in. Ashley and Brian, you will move mountains. Ashley knows as she goes through life, Brian will always be there to make her plans and dreams come true. Brian knows the same about Ashley even when he doubts himself. They will do it together because they love each other. <laughs>